Hey Jake, your dad and I have been working on a little surprise for you. A what? Uh, yeah, somebody had a birthday a couple week days ago. Oh, well, yeah, a week ago, I guess. Yeah, it was a week ago. Oh, somebody had a birthday, and uh, Matt Jackson and I were in cahoots. So, you want to see what your birthday present is? Is it not Davey? No, it's not Davey. Sure, I'll go look at it. It's not a 78 Vert. It's not a 67 Beetle. Well, why don't we take it back to the shop, and then we'll do an official it's unboxing. It's at the shop. No, yeah, I let's go back to the shop, and you can look at it. All right. Okay, I got it in the bus. So. Yes. All right. All right, let's go. Well, hello, VW Lifers. Uh, uh, Gary here with uh, the Matt Jackson and the Jake Garrison. Well, uh, this is uh, Jake's uh, happy birthday present. Yay! From the old man, from uh, our friends at Koch's. Uh, steering wheel restoration and Matt Jackson, what's the occasion for Helga getting a new steering wheel? Well, you know the steering wheel you hold it That's the thing you touch the most and mine is just so beat. It's nasty. I just wanted to do a little something for myself Oh, that's so nice. You, you mentioned Jake. You wanted to get him one a yes. surprise So uh, uh, Jake so we uh, we went ahead and got two and today's the big day Today's the, today's the grand opening. Yes, Koch's if you don't know uh, they are uh, out in uh, uh, Acton, California and those guys uh, you can send them a core uh, and they can rebuild build your steering wheel but as good as it was when it left uh, the factory many many moons ago so today we're going to uh, install two uh, steering wheels uh in one in helga and one in ziggy the bus and uh we have we'll show you the uh the steering wheel puller we have it's very nice that we're borrowing it from our buddy steve-o's man when you're pulling steering wheels it's something that makes it really easy so we're excited about this so stick with us today we're going to have some fun and put in uh, new steering wheels gosh it should be uh, hopefully a rather calm I event oh yeah this is this is like... Both of y'all steering wheels are kind of bad shape. Yes. Jake's has a flat edge all the way around it. I could use them. Oh, we're gonna need some kind of container. Or just, yeah, just, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, it's gonna bite me? Yeah. Oh, it's kind of... Ooh, like, look at this. Look at all the peanuts. Oh, my Jackson, oh, here. Gosh. I'll hold it right there. Okay. Ooh, oh, it comes in a little thing, too. Oh, so we got, turn yours upside down. We got so. bubble wrap. Yeah, I'm gonna put my bubble wrap. Well, I'm I can't wait to see what they look like. Me too. I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah. Wait, wait, yeah, wait, let's do it together at the same time. Come on. Yeah, yeah. All right. All right. Oh, they're All right. orange. All right, ready? All right, here we go. Two, two three. three. Oh, my look at those not all buttons. Oh, my gosh. gosh. <laughs> all right, I want one. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh my god. Wow. All right, these are uh, the redone quality. for the guys over at, at Koch's in California. The and unbelievable. Look at those uh, Look horn that quality, buttons. man. Yeah, we will say this is not sponsored by Koch's. We're just like everyone else, but sometimes we like nice things. Yeah, and, and, well, I think it's kind of a thing like, you know, we have people that do things in the business. Uh, Volks bits in his carburetors, and Glenn Ring with his distributors, and uh, Koch's and steering wheels. It's yeah. good to have people out there in the Volkswagen community use these people. I mean, we're not paid with that. We bought these just like y'all bought they would buy these uh we're not this is not a paid advertisement or anything like that this is straight up but holy cow look at the craftsmanship on those i cannot wow 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 those are beautiful the so color is we'll, perfect so now we'll have to pull our steering wheels we'll have to transfer the, the uh, little, turn ring yep the turn ring we'll have to change that out and then uh put, put the these wire. on oh my gosh i think jerry's gonna be jerry needs a black one yeah that is oh my gosh dude i think first thing first is get the horn off that's where all the hippies used to hide their stash back in the day. Oh yeah, they put their little J's right there? Yeah, that's what I heard. I, I, I wouldn't know anything about that though. Again, I could be doing this wrong, Matt Jackson, but we'll find out. <laughs> you want me to disconnect the battery? I don't think it's a 22 either. <laughs> Can you go disconnect the battery? <sighs> Looks like little remnants of silver paste in there, Matt Jackson. Oh, it came right off. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't lift it up. What do I do? Dum, 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 dum. Yep. Like so? Yep. So we had to disconnect the battery because otherwise your horn would be going off the whole time. And the old man always says it's smart to uh, take off your battery because you like never, never want to fire. Whoa, look at that. Am I doing this right? Yeah. Yep, you don't have your, the turn, the turn re resetters, you have it positioned correctly. Yeah. I remember the blue bus it just popped. 
Good Lee. lord. This, this is supposed to be tightening this bolt, right? Yeah. It's gonna be pulling up on yeah, it. Yeah, you wanna hold that so I can kind of torque this? The thing is, you don't want it to pop up in your face. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> there it went. Oh. That's it. That's all my, you want to have. My manly sound effect there. Ah, my boss is on a steering wheel. Oh, that crack's new from this. Just now. Is it? Yeah. Really? All right, we gotta take this off. Bummer. It's a special tool. So that goes on underneath the steering wheel. When you tighten the bolt, the good old simple machine of a screw, it pulls it together. And so it kind of presses that and it raises it up. That's a really nice little tool. And uh, well, they're they're really stuck a lot of times. Oh yeah, they are really on there because uh, that's something you know, one nice strong contact. Uh, fun fact about the old man, also known as the bus guru. Once upon a time, he was looking at SO42, all original. This is back in the early 2000s, back before buses were crazy. And he's going to look at it. And he goes, he goes, ah, the steering wheel's too loose. And he walked on the $500 SO42 because the steering wheel was too loose. So this little ring is the thing that cancels your turn signal. Uh, before you do, uh, you, yeah, I was gonna say you need to pop off that other. Time to upgrade your seats too, Jack. Well, you want it pretty snug. You don't want it loose. <laughs> this is the, the the main thing. So put it on there. I, I'm sure there's a torque spec on there. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. That's tight. Yeah, it's still coming down a little bit. I mean, that's good. I mean, you know, hopefully in the grand scheme of things, you never have to pull that off, the steering wheel off again, but. So your wire goes in that tiny hole with the tiny. Little Allen head, yeah. That's your horn. Nice need a snap audio. You're hot. How does it feel? It feels awesome, man. Happy birthday, AJ. Thanks, Dad. Is that, hey. is that nice? That's so nice. Grant. When Grant, yeah, we pulled the wheel off that one. Because it was a good wheel. Yeah, and well, we used Ziggy's. This. It was Ziggy's. It was? Yeah, and we used no. this. No, I'm, I'm sure on that. I thought Ziggy's was that old Ziggy's had, Ziggy had a raw uh, rod right here yeah. when we first got Ziggy. So, oh. And it's off. Yeah, at least we had the specialty tool. Wow. I uh, probably didn't need the steering wheel puller on that one, Matt Jackson. <laughs> no. Holy moly. That's okay. Are you going down an old oil road one day and all of a sudden, hey! <laughs> whoa! I'm like, <laughs> whoa! You know, that and a pick. Yeah, this has a lot to go down. Now give me some more. Nope, bigger. Oh, 24. Did y'all get it? Uh, what was the the little thing was backwards? It, the wheels steering wheel turned like the wheels. Oh, okay. Yeah, I might be maybe tighten it this time, Matt Jackson. <laughs> pretty tight. Jiminy crickets. That's pretty good. You think? Yeah. Here, do the old flex, flexi flyer. Let's see. <laughs> Hmm. Alright, test it. Uh, you gotta be you gotta be inside it. Oh you do? Yeah. Okay. Just make it your ground. Okay, let me get it centered perfectly. Oh my nice. gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my Matt Jackson! I just want to say thank you to Kachas. This is this is so beautiful. I'm so happy right now. It is. It is nice. Oh man, They're, look at this. I'm so jelly of you two guys now, man. Yeah, we're gonna have to get you on, Gary. Yeah, Jerry's gotta like step up his ball game now. It's nice. Kachas does a good job. Look at that fit and finish. And then those horn buttons are like beautiful. They are beautiful. Take that off? Yeah, take that. Just take this housing off. I wanna show we'll do a good little oh, tech okay. tip. Alright. Okay, Matt Jackson. There's the screws right yep. there. So, um, a common thing on uh, your bus, you see it all the time, is your turn signal stalk housing moves back and forth, right? And you see people, they wrap it with duct tape. I'm gonna show you how to do this. Okay. So you need to get you some sandpaper and a flat surface in my flat top here. And so this is just some 320. And what you're gonna do is, you're just gonna do this right here, okay? So what you're doing is you're making this smaller, Okay, and you'll just it'll be really snug on there. You don't have to use any tape. Ah. Okay, so because what happens is over time, of course, your steering column wears a little bit. So you just do this on a nice. Make sure it's a flat surface. They can already see the metal exposed. Yeah, you can see like some of those high. So we're like knocking it on the high spots. So when you go to clamp it back around your steering column, it's gonna be nice and straight. 
So this is just a little tech tip for you boys. There you go. Nice. You're good to go, buddy. Hey, um, we went from this to that. Yeah, what a day. Oh my gosh. And you guys, I'm very proud of y'all. I was kind of just watching. I did a little filming. I was, I was kind of the straw boss today. Straw boss, see? Uh, straw boss, see? I didn't yeah. have to do much, see? Look at the straw here, Jay. Uh, you need to get that screw there right there, Jay. <laughs> uh, very impressed with the work from Koch's. Yes, Koch's is uh, very good quality. Went on very easily. Yeah, yeah. It was, and everything's perfect, and the horns work, and the, the horn buttons look uh, just absolutely stunningly beautiful. Golly, guys, that's it. Now we're uh, off to the races again, right? If you guys want some VW Life merch, there's a link below. Well, got some. Look, you can get a TJK shirt. Right. Or Vita Blue Goliath. or black. Yeah. And rumor has it, the menace is back on the market. <laughs> yes. <laughs> who knows what time it's Yeah, so who knows? But so check your yeah, eBay well, listing. Yeah, Somebody, the, the guy who bought the menace, it's back for sale. It was too menacing. <laughs> it was. You couldn't handle it. Uh, people have asked about the, the 78. 78's mm -hmm. over there. Yep. Old spots in the garage. Spots, yeah, we're cleaning them up. But I was going to do work today till steering wheel time came. So, right. no, man. Uh, yeah, the 78 Vert's going to be on the block soon. We'll give a kind of a good rundown on that before we uh, put it out there so y'all can see it. Tell your aunts, tell your uncles, tell everybody you know about VW Life. We do this for you guys, the Volkswagen community, because we are the Volkswagen community. All of us. This is what mm -hmm. makes it happen. Thank you for your comments and everything, everybody. And uh, Matt Jackson and Jake, I'm really stoked for Helga and Ziggy with their new steering wheels. Uh, I'm very proud. Thank of you, you for guys. the birthday gift, old man. You're welcome, buddy. You're welcome. Oh.